Nothing lasts forever. Not the good or the bad. Not the happy or the sad. Not even the mundane moments we so often see as dull and boring, without ever really realizing that these moments, in between now and the next exciting time of our lives, are the reason for which we are able to enjoy life. When you watch a movie, you don't skip to the best part. You watch the movie in its entirety, as every conflict, character, and plot twist serves an important role in the storyline. Life is like a movie in the way that we, too, experience conflict and resolution. I'm learning, every day, to appreciate my lows so that I can enjoy my highs that much more. If every moment of our lives was fun and easy, we would be unable to appreciate it because we wouldn't know any different. We as humans spend most of our lives searching for happiness. But happiness is not a destination. Happiness is not something to have or to hold. Happiness, like sadness, is fleeting. What does belong to us, though, is our stories, our memories, our perspective on any given day. My one piece of advice in regard to life and living it would be to squeeze the juice out of every moment like you would a lemon while making lemonade. It may sound cheesy, but there is no day like today. We are only promised the moment we are living in at this very second. And if you're really lucky, you'll get to spend some of your precious seconds with people who feel like the sun. People who make you want to dance. People who make you laugh. People who absolutely shake up your world and remind you of the fact that you are living, you are breathing, and you are a part of the beautiful human experience. We come into this world alone, and we leave this world alone. But every person, every soul, that we meet in between is a gift. My 19 years of existence has taught me that every person that walks into my life has something to teach me, something to show me about the world. Life is truly bizarre if you think about it. I don't know why we are here. I don't know what the greater purpose of all of this is, but I do know this. Your chances of even existing right now are one in 400 trillion. I also know that the sun rises every day without fail and the sun sets every day without fail. We wake up in the morning our hearts beat, and we don't even have to think about breathing. So if there's anything that I know about this life, is that it is a miracle to be living it. And I don't know why that fact is so easy for me to forget, but I have decided to dedicate my days to feeling a sense of fulfillment and gratitude simply because I exist simply because I get to say and think and feel and believe, simply because I get to dance, simply because I have a fire inside of me like no one else and it is mine. I am choosing to wear rose-colored glasses so that I can be a believer of the goodness despite the bad, so that I can embrace all happiness and sadness for exactly what it is, so that I know that every goodbye will come with a brand new hello. The thing about letting go is that it's easier said than done, 
but once you make the conscious effort to do so, the universe will return the favor. So let go. Let go so that you can heal. Let go so that you can love. Let go so that you can begin to start again without fear or doubt or judgment. And most importantly, never forget that you are a walking, thinking, breathing, living miracle.